We've got people on the phone who have real life issues right now. Vicky is in Bournemouth. Good morning, Vicky. Good morning. Hi, Vicky. Hi. Vicky, I'm so sorry. Sorry, I jumped the gun with the empathy. What was the actual problem? <laughs> sorry. Well, I've had uh, quite a bad problem, actually. Um, I've had semi permanent eyebrows done. Um, which was very painful mm. and unfortunately the girl has completely messed them up and I've got one that is thicker and higher than the other. Tattooed oh. on your on your face? Yeah, yeah. semi-permanent, six months yeah. to wait till they fade and they're, pr- <laughs> they're pretty bad, honestly. Sorry for laughing. Yeah. I, no, no, it's fine. I've even had to have a fringe cut in to hide them because I oh. cannot walk around like this. So it's real honestly. bad. Here's what I would do. If it's only six months, i just kind of you know, go big or go home. Match them out. Get the other one just the same as the as, as the one that you don't like. Add a tiny little gangland teardrop, right, to scare your enemies, right? Because you don't you you right. want to scare your enemies. And whatever enemies you have, always remember leave no male heirs, right? Because right. they'll come okay. back to haunt you with some Count of Monte Cristo style revenge. Right, gotcha. Uh, that's and- sort of a mix of Ryan advice and Deadpool advice. But you 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 got more though. I love that advice. Yeah. Well, there's. I, I tried to even them out by penciling them in, and I end up looking more like Martin Scorsese, which is not the look <laughs> I'm going for. Oh, no, I no, think no, that's no. A, yeah. I think that's a hot look for a, a, a young girl from Bournemouth. The thing is, guys, she's actually offered me a free treatment to rectify it, and that's my problem. Do I risk it all again? Oh. Wow. Oh, we have a solution go, here. Go for it. Because it's fine until the wind blows uh-huh. and my fringe moves and everyone yeah. can see it. I, I know. I have the problem myself. Yeah. Here's my question. Is it very expensive to go to someone else? Uh, it's about £400, I think. Oh, God. Yeah, I want yeah. it. I bet yeah. I, I, I skip that tattoo. Go get a full back piece from a real tattoo artist. I've, um, already, got, I've already got one. Oh, wow. Okay, I think you're going to have to roll the dice and go with the same person. Let them fix it. Yeah. Thank you very much. Okay, we love you, Vicky. Love you, bye. Bye, 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 bye. Uh, morning, Jane in Chiswick. Morning. Hi, Jane. How are you both? We're great. What's your dilemma from Ryan Reynolds? Well, there's this guy at work, mm-hmm. and he keeps making food and bringing it in for me, but I don't want to eat it. Yeah. And it's kind of got to that stage where I'm running out of polite ways to decline. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I've ended up eating food I don't like. Mm-hmm. How do I stop it? This, oh is a, this is a very hard one. You're going to have to go in here, and you're going to have to tell him what he doesn't want to hear. That you don't want him touching your private bathing suit parts and he should bring food to someone else. <laughs> Do you know what? I think maybe that is the only option. So I'm, I'm like, is it him trying to flirt with me? Or I'm mean, actually his boss. I'm like, is he just trying to get my good side? I'm not sure. Oh, it oh, could be a bit of both. Yeah. Little inner work, well, work exactly. romance. That, that happens is- around this radio station a lot, I can mm. tell when I walked in. Oh, mm-hmm. do you reckon? Um, I, so, so do you like the guy? Is he handsome? Do you, are you into no, him? No, completely no. not handsome. Completely no. not that nice. Oh, wow. And he doesn't even have a winning personality. That's No. Oh, oh. And, but the thing is, it's, it, I guess it's a very British way. I'm so polite. Like, oh, no, I've yeah. had lunch. Or oh, no, I've tried everything. You're going like, you're, you're to have to fire him. I think you should. I think oh, that's the sensible thing. Actually, yeah. That's yeah. probably a good solution. Yeah. yeah. That's yeah, the it's, great what, it's sort of what they would George Costanza from Seinfeld would do. I you know, Just, and that's sort of how I mark good advice in life. What would he do? <laughs> no, I think that might be right because I, I there's only so much sausage, pickled onion, and beetroot stew I can eat. Oh. You know, Jane, I've thought of twelve jokes that aren't appropriate for radio right now, so <laughs> I, we're gonna have I, to I go. Oh, God. We're gonna have to go. I could do this all day. This is fun. I could advice. do this all day. We should. We really should. We I really skip should. the other interviews. Yeah, just suck it off. Yeah, right. One.